Oh, we're melting him. We're melting him. That's crazy. Oh, he just melted that guy. The brand new Gecko 2.0 weapons are here and it is a family of brand new Gecko weapons. So there's the light, medium, and heavy version. So read this, light laser weapon that does not require reloading. During continuous firing, three additional lasers turn off in turn, disabling each laser reduces the total damage of the gun by 25% up to 75%. Not sure what that last part means, but it sounds like the longer you fire, the weaker they get if that makes any sense. So I think these are Korean laser weapons. I think these are pronounced Hwanji. The other ones are Danji and I don't know. I might just be butchering this in Yoji maybe. I, I'm not really sure. Someone correct me in the comments. But straight off the bat, they look like they fire lasers. Honestly, they kind of look like a laser weapon. But it looks like there's three barrels to each weapon. So that's maybe what they mean by three lasers per weapon. But let's try these things out on the test server. Okay, here we are, first map. First map, first game. Here we go, let's try them out in the Kepri. We're, this is the light version, obviously, of the weapon first. So there's a light, medium, and heavy weapon. And this is one weapon where, I actually remember even like, when I started playing the game in like 2014, 2015, when player, that's a lot of damage. That's a lot of damage. I remember when players were saying in like 2018, why isn't there a new Gecko weapon? And it's funny, because they've had the Flux, They've had the Prisma for heavy weapon slots, but now finally a new weapon. Hold on, I'm just adjusting a setting here. The, the test server is super buggy right now. It's like it's restarted on me a couple times and it's super messed up. So hopefully we can get through this game. So look at this, there's three lasers per, sh per weapon. So three lasers and then it looks like they continuously fire, but they overheat and then stop shooting all three. Oh, we just got locked down. <sighs> okay. So I'll hold down, I'm trying to kill this, that's a fury there. That's crazy damage. Remember, we, whoa, we almost smoked him. My teammates are running the same weapons. Oh, I forgot to look at the range. What was the range, 800 meters? I completely forgot to even look. Hwanji, Doji. Okay, I'm gonna get closer here, I'm gonna get closer. They straight up are a gecko 2.0 weapons. They fire three lasers per weapon, obviously way more damage. Up close. Oh, come on, teammate. My teammates... Oh, the Titans are charged up already? Maybe that's some test server thing. Where Titans charge up way too fast in the test server. Because mine's charged up too right now. Okay, we're getting close with these. I... Okay, last day in I don't think they deal more damage up close or further away. I think it's the same damage. Um, no matter if you're close or far. Okay, man. It's... It's hard to... Here we go. Here we go. So look, we're firing the weapons, we're holding the button, and now it's one. Now it's one. So it goes from three to one laser as they overheat. So if the weapons overheat, you only shoot one laser, and I assume that's weight, that's less damage because it's less lasers. Laser. Let's ditch, because I want to try out some of these other builds. Let's go Behemoth. Let's see how this Behemoth. This is going to be the highest firepower one. I forget which, which one. Are these the Goji or? I don't even know. Somebody tell me. Please. Okay, that was melting. Somebody stole my kill, but we were just melting that kid titan. So this is four heavy gecko 2.0s. Melting, melting. Last day triggered on the Seraph. He's flying right now. Man, look at the fire. So they, they spin almost. They're like a minigun laser weapon. The weapons actually spin as they're firing. That's Miramids. Do not shoot me, Miramids. Do not shoot me. Oh, um, I think this is going to pop out. we got a four cap right now. See how it's super laggy? That's the test server. Oh, we're melting him. We're melting him. That's crazy. Oh, he just melted that guy. So these ones are called the Hwanji. I think you ignore the H, right? It's just Wanji. Someone will let me know. I'm butchering all the names. Oh, look. This must... The, the weapons on our back right now are, like, tilted. Okay, Skyros. Oh, he just went into stealth. He just went into stealth. These are Mark III weapons too, though. So these, these aren't Mark VIII. Uh, hold on, hold on. They say Mark VIII. These aren't level eight weapons. These are Mark III max weapons. Without a few of the upgrades, but for the most part, these are max damage level. Melting, melting. Somebody stole my kill again. That is some crazy damage. 
But then again, this is a behemoth with Wanji. So these aren't going to be... This isn't exactly an, a good way to tell if they're overpowered just because the behemoth is so powerful with pretty much any heavy weapon. So this is more of a... Uh, I don't know. This is more of a... Just a test. That's why it's called the test server. That's some heavy damage. There we go. There we go. Melting, melting, melting. And deleted. Double kill. That was a full health cap, I think. This guy's here. We have a four cap. And as per usual, no one on the test server gets any beacons. So let's try out. Actually, let's just try out. Let's try the Seraph. This game's about to end. And hopefully we can get into another one. The test server is like bugging out and crashing so much. Hopefully we can get into another game here. Okay, that's a behemoth for Smuda. Here we go, here we go. So look, the longer you fire, it's, that's really weird, I'm just noticing now. So it goes from three lasers per weapon, to two lasers, to one weapon, or to one laser. So three, two, one. It just decreases the amount of lasers and the damage output. But they never run out of ammo. You never actually have to reload them if you want to just keep firing. Okay, there we go. Win on the Vic on the test server doesn't mean anything, but those are the new Gecko laser weapons. We actually didn't try the medium version, so let's drop into another game and try them out. I gotta load them up, um, so let's try them out on the Typhon. 3.4 million, not too bad for the first game, trying them out. Super bugged out test server. Let's go game two lasers. Okay, here we are. This is very different. Team deathmatch on carrier map. Um, is gonna be very different, and we're gonna have to brawl with these things. That's, that guy's running them on his Skyros. Oh, that guy's hacking. <laughs> Who hacks the tester? That is the most pathetic thing I've ever seen. Who hacks the tester? Skyros, move! Move out of the freaking way, man! Jaeger, Jaegermeister. Okay, last hand triggered. Last in trigger on that Jaeger. Let's get close. I do like the design. I mean, the color is a little bit too much. I like that's a Favnir. Deleted the Favnir. We gotta back up, back up. Oh, multiple guys shooting at us. Oh, we might die fast. There's four, three, four players, enemy players over here. Oh, he's that Jaeger. Bro, that Jaeger came out of no. <laughs> that idiot. He just. That Jaeger jumped at us, killed us. And then jumped off the map. He landed off the map and off the ship. I mean, it happens to the best of us. Best of us, but that was kind of funny. That was kind of funny. Okay, so that was the Typhon. Typhon's decent. Obviously, I'm, I assume it's as it should be: light, medium, heavy. The stronger the weapons get. Okay, this is a something. Everybody's running the lasers right now. Of course, because they're brand new. That guy's really hacking the tester. Okay, there's a kill. Man, this is close range too. Like, these are long range weapons, but even up close, they're dealing pretty good damage here. Okay, there we go. Okay, we're reloading. And melted, double kill. So these, it's weird, because the weapons don't even have a reload stat, but they still have a reload. Because if you're smart, you're gonna let the weapons cool down. Oh, this guy's gonna kill us. If you're smart, you'll let the weapons cool down so you can get them. It's kind of like the Nucleon. The Nucleon don't really have a reload, per se, but you want them not overheated so the bullet spray is minimal. So they should probably put that stat in the uh, in the stats. Stat in the stats. It's 10 Ryan right now. I'm having... Uh, this is early in the morning, and I am misspeaking a lot. I didn't have my morning meth. Okay. 10-10. <laughs> Oh, this guy's gonna kill me. What? 22,000 health. Okay, okay. E Hi oh, we were melting that handball for a second. Okay, this guy's still hacking. Stop hacking the test server. All the stuff is free, max level. The test server should be the one thing that you definitely never hack. Like, stupid. Oh, that's a nether. Oh, he could have tried out the nether build. The Nether's actually a lot squishier than you think when it doesn't have spear weapons. It doesn't have a whole lot of HP, and it's, yeah, it's pretty OP with the spear, but if it's not running the spear, not as much. We're actually down right now, and we gotta win. We gotta win this test server game, bro. Melt, melt, melt away, turn into chicken, double kill. Okay, okay, 
our last dance triggered. On the test server, I always run a last stand on the robots, or I try to, just because the robots seem to die so fast without the pilot skills and the drone shielding. Without the drone shielding, they die extremely fast. They've done a weird thing where Pixonics made drone shielding almost, like everyone hates drone shielding, but it's almost a necessity now because of how much damage the weapons deal. So if you don't have drone shielding, you'll just die instantly. And if they got rid of, oh, we're gonna melt this guy. Oh, I thought it was gonna kill that guy. If they just deleted drone shielding tomorrow, the weapons would steal too much. I dropped in my Kid Titan. I don't want to drop. That's the default Kid Titan on the test server. We're down by five kills right now. Okay, let's pull off the comeback. Let's pull off the comeback. Okay, he's dead. Oh, they're getting more kills, though. You, you melt, melt. There we go, kill. All right. Even up close, the weapons deal pretty good damage. All right. I mean, they don't deal like, I don't know, fainter damage up close, but still pretty decent. Okay, okay. Oh, come on. We almost have this guy. I don't want to die. I don't want to die. There. Oh, what? Teammate stole my kill. Same guy. Guy's running the same build as me. Seraph with the Wanji. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I did look. Hold on. Double kill there on that. Come on, let's kill this guy. Game's tightening up. It's 22-23 now. 22-23. It's a close game. We can do it. We can do this. 23-23. That's a Demeter. All right, all right. 23-23. That's a Seraph there. Taken off. Yikes. Okay, trying to melt, 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 melt. Oh, we just got hit. Whoa, we're flying like ground level now. That was weird. Oh, we're still down to the beacon bar. The weapons up close don't deal that much damage. You really only notice the damage when you're at range. But up close, it's really not as impressive. So that being said, it might actually be... The one thing is, I don't understand why you would run the, the heavy version of the Zwanji instead of the behemoth like Prisma. Like, why wouldn't you run the Prisma? Because we need Ether. Yeah, it just doesn't seem like they're really worth running. If you have Prisma, I wouldn't trade your Prisma in for these weapons. I mean, obviously they're gonna be adjusted before they hit the live server eventually, but still. Okay, he's dead. Man, I feel like all of our kills are getting stolen in this game. You're, you pulled off the comeback. We pulled off the comeback so far. The comeback. And, okay, let's drop in our last robot, our Mars robot, with whatever these weapons are called. I completely forget. Launch that. Boom. See you later, turret. Turret. Man, these things spin with lasers. Melt, melt, melt. Oh, he almost died. He almost died. We almost had him. One of these days, one of my kills is not going to get stolen. But I think that's going to pretty much wrap it up. We're up five... We're up five kills and there's one player left. And this guy turns into Rambo, then I think we have the kill. Okay, there it is. That is the brand new laser weapons. I know probably the first thing you are thinking is, we really don't need more weapons. The spear weapons, the tight weapons just came out. We don't need more content. And you may be right. But these definitely are the Gecko 2.0s. They do way more damage than the Geckos. There's a light, medium, and heavy. And they have three lasers in one weapon which is kind of a cool idea. This is what I'm talking about. Sawyer account is currently used on another device. That's not even possible. I don't even, this is a test server. I didn't make an account, but there it is. I don't think this is gonna load. Okay, there it is. Oh, almost. Gecko 2.0s. What do you guys think about these weapons? Cheese and lasagna. See you guys next time.